How to treat obesity. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. For more videos and tips, subscribe to the channel. Obesity is a disorder where you have an excessive amount of body fat. This disorder can increase your risk of heart disease, diabetes, and high blood pressure. It can also limit your mobility and lead to overall poor health. While there is no easy cure for obesity, reducing your body fat through adjustments to your diet and to your lifestyle can make it easier for you to shed your excess body weight. As a last resort, you can also treat obesity by taking weight loss medication or talking to your doctor about weight loss surgery. 1. Set realistic diet goals. Before you embark on changes to your diet, you should set diet goals that are realistic and possible to attain. Creating realistic goals will allow you to sustain your healthy eating plan and stick to healthy eating in the long term. 2. Create a healthy eating plan. One of the major ways to reduce your body fat is to focus on healthy eating. Creating a healthy eating plan will help to lower your body weight and treat your obesity. You can make a healthy eating plan on your own or with the help of a dietitian. Try to write out your healthy eating plan with meal plans for three meals a day for several months to a year. 3. Reduce your daily calorie intake. Cutting back on your daily calorie intake can help you to lose weight and maintain a healthy diet. You should first calculate your daily calorie intake and then determine how many calories you will need to cut every day to lose weight. On average, women should consume between 1,200 to 1,500 calories a day and men should consume between 1,500 to 1,800 calories a day. 4. Commit to making your own meals. Eating out can be expensive and add more pounds to your waistline. When you eat out, you have little control over what is being put into the food you are eating and it can be difficult to make healthy eating choices. Try to commit to making at least one to two meals a day at home that is in line with your healthy eating plan. 5. Limit foods high in sugar and saturated fat. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Sugar causes your body to store fat, and many products both at the supermarket and in restaurants contain large amounts of added sugar, which, combined with saturated fat, which contains more calories and more potential to affect cholesterol levels, greatly increases the risk of obesity. 6. Read food labels when you go grocery shopping. You should always go grocery shopping with a shopping list and read food labels before you buy anything. Look for any artificial or processed ingredients in foods, such as high fructose corn syrup or added flavorings. 7. Control your portion sizes. A portion is a certain amount of food that you consume for a meal or a snack. This is different than a serving, which is a measured amount of food and is required to be noted on all nutritional labels on food. Reducing your portion sizes every time you eat can help you to consume fewer calories and have control over how much food you consume. 8. Cut down on your alcohol intake. Alcoholic drinks contain a high amount of calories and sugar. If possible, reduce the amount of alcohol you drink every week and increase the amount of water you drink. Drinking water will help your body stay hydrated and healthy. 9. Avoid crash dieting. Though you may be tempted to try quick fix weight loss diets or drastic weight loss programs, these can often lead to other health issues and very little weight loss. Once you stop a crash diet, you will likely regain all the weight you lost. The only way to really lose weight and keep it off is to adopt healthy eating habits and maintain them over a long period of time. 10. Exercise several times a week. To achieve significant weight loss, you should commit to an exercise program four to five times a week, where you exercise 300 minutes or more a week. You can also start by doing 150 minutes of exercise a week to prevent further weight gain and improve your endurance and fitness. Focus on exercises that get you moving, such as aerobics, pilates, jogging, or interval training. 
You can also join a gym and work with a trainer on a fitness plan that will help you lose weight and gain strength. Weightlifting should only be done once you have a certain level of fitness. This is Kate for Nature Cures. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel.